Hey everyone, we didn't get a video out this week. Um, apologize for that. We're gonna, I've just, I've had a lot of other obligations going through right now and everything else. Uh, we're gonna get, get some more videos up soon. So I didn't have a video, so I'm gonna put up some drone footage. They're repaving near uh, my parents' house, so I flew over that. It was kinda neat. Uh, you can see all the smoke and stuff coming up. Um, kinda looks like Fern Gully. <laughs> the big, uh, the big scary guy on the machine because you got this big cloud of smoke coming up out of the trees. So, um, so anyways, I'm going to throw that up just just for it, I guess. Um, I haven't really had drone footage in a while either. Um, and I spent a lot of money on the drone, so I thought I'd try and use it a couple times here and there uh, before we head out. Um, also, I wanted to talk to you about the amazing bag sealer. All right, it does say it's amazing in the title, so it's got to be amazing, right? Um, this thing was just kind of neat. I just, I was walking by at the grocery store. They had it on sale for, it was, I think, $6.99. Uh, normally they're 10 bucks. Um, 10 bucks, I probably would have walked right by it, but just, I don't know, like six, seven bucks. I don't know. It just kind of hit me to get it. Um, so I looked up on Amazon. It's got mixed reviews. Um, but most of like the bad reviews were people saying like, oh, I didn't know it needed batteries. Would help if it, you know, needed battery or if it said on the package it needed batteries. Um, which I don't really see where it does say it needs batteries. Right at the bottom. Two AA batteries not included. I mean, it's it's a heat sealer. Obviously, it's going to take some type of batteries or power or something. Um, it does take just two AA's. If I can get it open. There we go. Just two AA's. Um, it's got a magnet on the back. And it's got a cutter on one end. So you can cut it you know, bags open, and then it's got the heat sealer on the other end. Um, and basically what you do is you press down and it heats up and then you move it across the bag. Um, it does, it actually, it works pretty well. Um, the only thing with, with it is different bags. You gotta kind of move a little bit different speed. So you gotta play around with that. And I think that's where it gets a lot of mixed reviews. Just people will try it really quick on a bag. Oh, it doesn't work. And it's like, well, that bag, you might have to move it a little slower, move a little faster or whatever. Um, it does come with instructions. It's got a little amazing bag sealer instructions. Boom. Uh, and it just talks about, it's one page, really easy. Um, talks about sealing and tips and cutting and all that kind of stuff. Um, but so anyways, I'll show you how it works really quick. And what it eliminates is all the bag clips and it actually seals up your food. And this is why I bought it, was in a camper Obviously, you don't want the food just like this. It's gonna smells are gonna get out more. Uh, you're gonna attract rodents and that kind of a deal. So I figured this for six bucks, well seven bucks. Uh, why not give it a shot? And it does actually seem to work. So here's just like a sandwich bag, um, and all you do is you hold down for a couple seconds, and then you just slowly move it across. And then it seals it. The sandwich bags, it seems to kind of cut it too. Um, again, you probably, I gotta move a little quicker. But, it does seal it. And this part's sealed. You can almost make little gloves. All right, so that's a sandwich bag. So it does work on sandwich bags, which isn't really why I bought it, but I bought it for like chip bags, cereal bags, that kind of a deal. Um, but like I said, it does have a cutter, so you can cut it open if you want. Um, and then the sealer, again, we just hold it for a couple seconds and then slowly start to move it across. And again, different bags will have different speeds that you need to go. And that's, like I said, that's where the mixed reviews are coming from. You got to play with it a little bit. Some you might have to move a little faster, some you might have to move, move a little slower. So, it is sealed. And to open it, well, it didn't even open when trying to pull it apart. So this one's sealed pretty good. To open it, you can use the little cutter. Across, and then open up the chips and then again when you're done you can seal it like I said it only takes two double A's um, 
you know, their regular price is 10 bucks, which isn't bad. Uh, but for camping, I really see this being pretty useful to seal up everything. Even if you're just going for a couple weekends or um, that kind of a deal. A lot of people still leave some food in the camper, so they're kind of half packed when they're ready to go. Um, but like I said, it's not, I wouldn't really call it amazing, but it, it's, it's pretty cool. Um, and like I said, it does work. Uh, you just have to do kind of different speeds and kind of play around with it to kind of see how to actually seal specific bags. Like I said, some will seal at kind of different speeds going across. Um, so check it out if you see one, pick it up. They are on Amazon for like 10 bucks. Like I said, it was on sale at the grocery store for 6.99. You might be able to find it on sale near you too. Um, but check it out. All right, here's some drone footage. Mm -hmm.